So, what we're doing today uh, here on uh, Skip and Derek's uh, home plumbing <laughs> <Long> services, <laughs> we're, we can't get the main shut off outside, so uh, we have a major decrease in power or in uh, pressure for this house. Um, it's a, we're doing a one bedroom basement apartment down here and we have a four bedroom upstairs, so we need to maintain pressure. Uh, got three quarter malleable copper coming in at the floor, drops down to half inch, increases back up to three quarter for the meter, but then immediately drops down to half inch again. So uh, we've got everything prepped, and what we're going to do is um, we're going to cut the we're going to cut the three quarter copper live, so it's under pressure. We've been told that it's um, it's sitting around, what, 70 pounds? 60, 70 pounds. 60, 70 pounds of pressure coming in here. But it's 47 degrees, so it's really cold. So we've cleaned up the copper. There was some um, so there was some solder on the back that we had to scrape off. We've cleaned up the copper. We have our, our cutter. And what we've made up here is a shark bite. So it's a, a union shark bite or a coupler shark bite 90 over to a couple we could have soldered all this at this point but we had bought the uh, our original plan was to put the ball valve over here but on the ball valves there's a little insert that has to slide down inside the pipe and there's not an insert on the on the coupler so once we make this cut, um, we will slide. We, we're we're going to attempt <laughs> to slide this uh, coupler over the pipe, and then as soon as it's on, we will shut the ball valve, and that's what our our plan is. If and then on the other end, we've got uh, three quarter to PEX. So from that three quarter to PEX, once that ball valve shut off, we can plumb the rest in. We're gonna bypass the meter temporarily, but then we can come up here to where the supply goes to the house and it drops down to half. If that doesn't work, we have a backup. We have a backup. <laughs> yeah. So it's just a piece of black pipe, uh, flexible black pipe with a ball valve on this end with half inch packs coming out the other. And if this fails, because once we make the cut here, this whole piece will come right out. We can just slide this down over top of it and turn off the ball valve, and then just plumb half inch pecs from there, and wait for the you know so we can actually get at the shut off out of the road. So we're gonna set up the camera over there out of the water <laughs> and make our cut and see what happens. So um, stay tuned. Yeah, stay tuned. <laughs> it's gonna be cold, man. Okay. Sorry. There. Get to it. Okay. Six 
successful. Okay, so I mean, we let this run for a while to clean it out because you can see how brown and dirty and crappy that is. It's the only reason we let it run. We could have done it faster, but uh, so shark bite is good. There's not even a drip coming out of it, eh, Skip? Nope. Looks pretty good. No, nope. not even a drip. Not cold. Got the bell valve shut off. The nice thing about these is we can rotate them. Yep. So, and then we're out to three quarter, all the water shut off, and now we just have to plumb in the Hex. meter, well, yeah, the meter for a bit, and we'll come back and uh, show you what it looks like when we're finished. Okay, so this is, uh, this is the finished result. It's bypassing the meter at this time, but at least, uh, the house has water and we'll, we have a ball valve where we can shut it off, we'll bring it up, put mount a board to the wall, put the meter back on and plumb it all back into the meter, but it's going to be three quarter throughout. We Even though we had the, behind us we have the laundry sink and it seems to have better pressure. Okay, that's it.